This is a lecture 8. This is about the parallel operation on single phase transformer. Also we will look into the parallel operation of three phase transformers. So the parallel operation of transformers are generally used to supply load more than that can be supplied by a single transformer. So if you have a load requirement in kilowatt amperes which uh, is more than what can be supplied from a single transformer. Suppose your load requirement is 100 kilowatt amperes and you, have, you can use two transformers, single trans transformers of 50 kilowatt amperes to supply that load. So the primary are connected to the supply bus bar in this case and the secondary are connected to the output bus bar. So the requirements for parallel operation of a transformer include that both the transformers should be connected to polarity and the primary and the secondary winding should have same polarity. Also the voltage rating of the both the transformers should be same that the transformation ratio should also be same. Also the reactance to resistance ratio should be same and the percentage impedance should also be same for both the transformers. If both the transformers are of different KVA rating, suppose one transformer is of 100 KVA rating and the other is of 50 KVA rating, then the equivalent impedance of the transformer should be inversely proportional to the KVA ratings. That's the one requirement of that should be satisfied for both the transformers in this case. So these are the conditions which should be satisfied so that the parallel operation of transformer can be done. So this is a simple connection diagram in which there are two transformers T1 and T2 and the primary winding of each of these transformers are connected to the source bus bar. You can see that the the windings or the connections of the both the transform with same polarity are taken together and it is connected to the positive and the other two are connected to the negative terminal of the supply and in the same way the secondary is sourced out also there is a switch which can be used to turn on or turn off the secondary supply and the secondary is connected to the load bus bar and the primaries are connected to the source bus bar considering the polarities of both the transformer windings or the primary windings. Again while doing the parallel operation of three phase transformers the same rules that will apply for the single phase transformer are also applied to three phase transformers. Also all the transformers should have similar construction that is in the three phase transformer if two units are used both should be either core type transformer or both should be shell type transformer. So this was all about the parallel operation of transformers. If you like this video please do subscribe, like and comment.